What's going on campers? Camp Facer here. Welcome back to another video and happy 4th of July weekend to all you horror movie fans out there. Camp Facer. <laughs> Today we have a very short and sweet one. I just wanted to keep you guys up to date. Are you guys a hardcore Scream fan or just a Scream fan in general? Well, if, if that's the case, that's fine. Well, I have some news for you guys. And you probably already know that Nev Campbell, who plays the role as Cindy Prescott, has recently, in the past, declined playing the role of Sydney in the upcoming Scream 6 film due to a salary dispute now, I don't know if she wasn't getting paid enough in the last film, Scream 5, or she just wasn't offered enough in Scream 6, or maybe she just has a lot going on her plate. But recently, the past few days, it's been announced, it's been leaked over on Twitter. I think Paramount has been trying to keep it quiet. So, this is a little spoiler alert, but she has reached agreements with Paramount to play the role as Sydney in the upcoming Scream 6 film. Now, that that is awesome, because what could... Scream B, we need we need Sydney Prescott. She's been the protagonist all along. She's been there since the first film. This is great. So she's gonna play a small part in Scream 6, but then they plan to use her as a lead character in Scream 7. I wonder what they're planning on doing with that. But this news to me, you guys, sounds fantastic. I wanna know what you guys think about Sydney being in the next upcoming or upcoming sequels to the Scream franchise. This franchise could live on because of the fact that there could always be a new Ghostface. It's an honor. Now let's dive into uh, predictions on upcoming Ghostface killers. I've always said that Stu should come back. You gotta have a sequel! I mean, why not? Why not Stu? I mean, a TV to the face does not execute the killer in my book. I know people have been arguing the fact. Come on, he's ahead of big tube TV electrify his face and the glass shatter on his head, but that did not 100% minus Stu out of the picture. He could always come back one way or another. I mean, maybe he didn't die. Maybe he's got scar tissue and he almost died and he was in the hospital and then somehow um, they planned on putting him away and throughout that time maybe something happened where he, he, he pretended to fake his death after that and he ran off from the, the law and now they're like oh we're gonna lock him up in prison but then he ended up dying uh missing maybe he oh the body went missing in, in a lake or or the ocean and we couldn't find the body but now maybe Stu is back behind the ghost face mask that would be freaking awesome i want to see uh Stu come back I mean, Matthew Lillard, he has such a great, funny character, especially from the first film. He's crazy. He's he's nuts. He's a nutcase. That, to me, is Ghostface. Uh, Billy, he had a shot to the head. I mean, there's no denying he's dead. I mean, he's he's definitely gone, but, but Stu could come back. I want to know what you guys think. Do you guys think Stu could come back? You see, we ask you a question, and if you get it wrong, book out! die if so leave a comment down below let's make a discussion about this it, it's a lot of fun anyways i hope you guys are having a great weekend stay safe make sure to like subscribe click notifications so also you don't miss a video in the future and i will see you guys at camp and as always campers stay out of the woods <laughs> <laughs>